Hi guys, we are going to learn how to use the take plot program for curves and contours depicting, I mean XY plot or contours or vector also we can use take plot to uh, uh, depict or draw the curves. Now we are going to in the first step to uh, draw curves. So first this is the uh, interface of the take plot. This is uh, version 8, but before we use the tech plot, we have to, uh, I mean, export the data for XY uh, data. For example, if we have this XY, okay, this for example, A column means X, B columns means Y, and then we have to export, just uh, shade it, and then copy then go to the notepad he just passed ok and then save us for example on desktop you folder let be tech plot data alright open and then this should be x for example x y plot it should be d a t must be d a t all right should be d a t mean data save and then after that we can open the tech plot and then import or load data Then we have to go to desktop and then go to the tech plot. This one. Ah, you can see xy plot data dot dat. Okay, open. Right. This is the cave. As you can see. Okay. And then, if you want uh, to, I mean, uh, edit this curve, only double click on the curve. Alright. You can see uh, the map name, just edit the name for this curve. Let me, for example, uh, this uh, in mechanical engineering, for example. Uh, this will be in a certain number, for example. Okay, all right. And then, for example, if we want to edit the uh, uh, line, for example, uh, line type polynomial. This depends on the fitting of the power fit, for example. Our power fit is more accurate. Uh, line thickness maybe 0.8 is more thick 0 0.4 0 0.4 is okay uh, for example are uh, the style of the is uh, solid now would you like to take as dash or dash dot is depend on you okay let me solve okay and then line color for example red it is already red black or any color okay yellow or blue let me blue okay now it's close all right, all right. Uh, how to edit the, the uh, x y uh, just to go, go to the x from here x uh, axis axis and then edit the axis now here we have the min minimum and maximum value for the x X is no problem for the uh, maximum value for example uh, this point zero point oh two five but for the uh, minimum value for x let me in minus because the you can you know this one is unclear shown so let me for example minus zero to zero zero one for example just click here you can see it is shifted 
to the right side all right now what about the y the y is i think is okay okay now we have to go to the y y is okay no problem okay then we have to go to the grid okay range exceeds scale factor limit okay what happened now we are going to the uh, ticks for example if not auto uh, if not auto you can range this one or dispute as we would like 0 5 starting from 0 I think it's more accurate for the y axis if you don't like to take as uh, 1000 you can use for example 2000 this 10,000 20,000 okay starting from I think if we take as 1000 10,000 okay 10,000 20,000 okay zero you have to know that there is 25 25 25,000 okay so here we can use 10,000 or 15 it's okay it's up to you okay therefore x axis okay label now this is the font and color if you want to take as for example red right is for y the font style times okay uh, here the if you take as a float like uh, how many position of that after this one for example zero okay note one but if you exponential also can like this okay best float okay angle you can use for example 45 degree if it is so long okay offset this for example how oh, I mean the size 150 is so small two so more feet is three okay skip if you use two it will skip between uh, each two series numbers zero or uh, use one okay 15 percent title if you don't like to use this title for the y axis y axis is the second number okay now the font let's be helvetica and then the size this one and offset i mean the distance from here to the y axis if it is i mean not long enough take more than this i think it's okay at the center or left it's up to you right let me at the center same for the y axis this will be x, I mean the long, the length of the duct, same font, and then if 4 is not enough, it will be 6, it's okay, no, underline, if it's not black, no. let be red, I mean the x axis, I think black is more suitable. And this is the thickness if you want to be more thick. So, sub Point 0.4 for example. 
area if you don't like to show the, the date okay just show border this to show fill area and then this is the background you can see close and then for the frame edit current frame he show border no need just to remove the date okay show background like this close now it is ready to export for example uh, publish sorry write that Okay. okay, go to edit, copy, like to clipboard. Okay, and then go to, to the word. Okay, You can make them the same color for example double click here or axis edit uh, go to the tick label red okay close and then copy to report Nice. Okay. High resolution for this curve.